if you're anything like me, you're sitting there and you're thinking, so what next? Where do I go from here? And uh, anybody who's on any type of journey, whether it's a religious journey, educational journey, eventually going to get to this question of what do I do next? And uh, that's kind of where I am with this this channel. It's, it's a pretty small channel. I've got a couple of viewers and most of them are uh, related to either my job working for the church or Christian camp or friends I know from Facebook or or whatever. But, you know, where does where does this channel go from here? And I've got a couple ideas. See, when I look at the channel, I see it as something that's focused mainly on middle to high school students with topics that are condensed into little 10 minute segments that are easily digestible and you can watch it quick on the go and get a little a uh, little devotion from it. But, you know, in the Bible, we talk about the uh, Apostle Paul and he said something very interesting that he wanted to be all things to all people. And I think that's what this channel can can do a lot better is try to hit up different audiences because it does a really good job of focusing at that age group. But what about the older group or what about the younger group? What about the parents of these students? And I've come up with a couple ideas. Oh, my first idea is kind of ambitious. Actually, all these ideas are a little ambitious, but the first one is maybe once every week or once every other week, you can do some type of uh, long forum discussion. And you see this a lot on some of the more famous podcasts where people sit down and they discuss these these interesting deep ideas for an hour or more. And we could do 45 minutes to an hour, um, maybe even longer than that if it goes well. But sometimes there's just not enough time in a 10 minute segment to get to the meat of an issue. And you need more time. Uh, there's a lot of uh, complicated issues around the world. There's a lot of complex theological questions that people have. And it would be interesting to sit down with some people who are knowledgeable about different subjects and just have a conversation and see where it goes. I think that could be very, very interesting. Um, that's one of my hopes for maybe leaning more into an, an older audience. And uh, I wouldn't stop with the 10 minute videos because I think they they fit a very important um, place in, you know, filling a short term need for what we all have or um, getting a very important information or message out there very quickly. But we can do so much more in 45 minutes to an hour than we can uh, in 10 minutes. Uh, as far as a younger audience goes, um, one of the things I've been with is the idea of object lessons and visual aids and maybe uh, using some of the different um, object lessons to teach at, at el an elementary level some of the different concepts uh, that we present to them in Christianity. That way parents will feel comfortable when, you know they're always like, oh, watching one of James's videos. Uh, I wonder what are the topics they're talking about. Is it you know these more mature topics or are they things for these you know younger groups but we can I can have some videos titled uh, so that they know what maturity level these videos are kind of leaning towards um, and you know you're never too old to get something from an object lesson some of us are just more visual learners uh, finally the last idea I have is some sort of like book review of uh, in the age we live in, there's so much information that's just getting thrown at us all the time. And if you're a parent or a student and you're looking at, you know, you're interested in a topic, but you don't know much about it, or you don't know if it's a trusted source or the things they talk about, or, you know, it's really hard to, to read or watch or listen to everything that goes in front of your children or in front of yourself. So, uh, you know, you could let me do it instead. I think it would be great for me to uh, review different books or videos or any type of media and kind of put a Judeo-Christian perspective on it and have that up here for people to see. It'd be pretty helpful. Um, it'd be helpful for students to kind of know what they want to go towards next. And it'd be useful for parents to kind of know 
what their kids are reading or watching or listening to, getting into. But I think uh, those are all some interesting ideas, but I want to hear back from you guys. I want to hear if that would be something that you're interested in, if that would be something that you would spend your time watching. So uh, please leave uh, some information back for me. Give me some feedback. Uh, if you have a different idea, give that to me and we can work with that. Um, but I think that this could help the channel grow. It could help us grow spiritually. And uh, it could, I just want to use some of this momentum we got from, uh, from camp. Because if you don't use it, you lose it. And, uh, you know, I'm just trying to turn this into uh, a long-term process so that we can get some, some good gains from here at the end. But please uh, respond. Give me some information. Give me some feedback. You're all having a good day.